Oh my jimmies, yeah, back with another Coming to your life, yeah, straight from the gutter Don't know me, well I came from my mother Looking so sweet, yeah, like another butter Switching up flows, oh yeah, here I go Only did these vibes for my new intro No, but seriously, hope you guys enjoyed this video What's going on guys, it's your boy, it's Kaza And we're back with another one Today, we are going to be reacting to Bounce Back by Khan. Now, someone said in the comments that this was one of his favorite styles by Khan, so I was very intrigued by that. Pretty sure I reacted to two of the other songs he said in there, um, but I am interested in the other ones he said, because this man has told me some pretty fire Khan songs, so I put my trust in him. So without any more talking, let's just get right into this and uh, see what Khan's got cooking. Yo, this is giving me like Ray J and fucking like Neo type vibes. I, I don't know why. It just the, the, the beginning is definitely giving me those type vibes. I don't know the beat and just the I, I don't know. What vibes are you guys getting from that beginning part? Because to me, it's definitely giving me like Ray J, Neo. I don't even know. Just those types of vibes. It, it's, it's wild. It's wild. I'm liking it though. I'm liking it. It's nice and smooth and I don't know it's just feel good type vibe Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay, so I just want to say that I love the fact that he said, how are, how the fuck are you going to critique me when you don't know what the fuck I've been through? You don't know what I just went through today, yesterday, th the day before, the past month, the past years. You don't know what I've been through, where I came from, what I grew myself from you know so how are you going to critique what i'm doing like i love that i love that because so many people are so quick to just they don't even think you know they don't think where anyone came from they don't think of the backstory they don't think of just anything the circumstances you know and they just are so quick to judge anyone you know just by their appearance just by you know, just by anything, you know, they take one quick look at you and they have their opinion on you, you know, and that's not the way it should be. It definitely should not be like that. So I really like that. Um, but I also like when he was like, he's living in, you know, the day and age where it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what, you know, your content is about. It doesn't matter if you're spitting real shit. It just matters if you're popping or popular, you know, or mainstream nowadays, you know, and that's all that matters. And that's so true, you know, like if you're just doing what's hot nowadays, then you're going to be popping, you're going to be mainstream, blah, blah, blah. But if you're actually putting your heart and soul into shit and just spitting real, actual, genuine music that people can relate to and people can just sit back and chill to you know and you know it isn't it just isn't mainstream then they're not gonna be as popping and getting the same numbers as the other people that are following the trends you know what i mean and that that is true as fuck so i i am digging this it, he came in with an incredible flow too he always does like i'm pretty sure it was obviously him singing that chorus but like you would expect him to come in with like a slower flow but like the beat i don't if it just made that 
big ass drop and then he just fucking came in and it was it was dope as fuck honestly you even understand what I'm going through I'm in the business where the numbers matter more than the product You might get caught up, your whip take it up Says I got my back against the wall I throw these records out with reckless abandon I hope I'm afraid of one of them sticks Still slumming your dick, still spitting the shit Still out of the mix, my shit fresh, your shit out of the box Ooh, yo, that was fire Yo, if you listen to that He makes it so Like, some of the words go in this ear And then it goes in this ear And then in this ear you know, like it's playing in both, and then all of a sudden, words in this ear, words just in this ear, words just in. The, bro, that was fire. That was fire. Hold up, I gotta play that back. That was. I was not expecting that. Got my back against the wall. I throw these records out with reckless abandon. I hope I'm afraid of one of them sticks. Still slumming your dick, still spitting the shit. Still out of the mix, my shit fresh. Your shit out of the box. You out of your mind, you out of your lane. I'm out of this world, I'm out of the hurry. I heard a horse is an all trash. I step back and fall in line. A wise man once said, Be patient, be patient. All good things, they come in due time. Everybody don't ball like they Chris Duhan. Everybody don't push the beam. My bands are bandy. Some of us are broken. Hope this pocket's empty. Me, I wanna find some peace of mind myself. So yeah, I may be down right now, but not forever. Oh man, oh man, I love what this man, what he's about, and he doesn't care about materialistic things, he doesn't care about money, he doesn't care about any of that shit, following the trends like I was saying before, he just wants to be himself, and just make the music that he's always been making, the music that is true to himself the music that inspires people the music that you know you can listen to sit down to really relate to it the music that makes you think you know khan is another artist that has a song for everything you know like you're sad he has a song for that you want to feel happy he has a song for that you want to get in like an aggressive mood he has a song for that you want to just feel pumped up? He has a song for that. You know what I mean? Like, this man is just an incredible fucking artist. And I just love the fact that he's so pure, I guess I would say. You know what I mean? Like, he's not fake at all. He's 100% real. And that's the best part about an artist that you can get. You know what I mean? That's the best trait. And if you're not real nowadays as an artist, you're just going to be played like a rag doll you know because you can just switch up your attitude to anything to just fit into the crowd that you're in at that point in time you know what i mean and that's not i don't know i don't know there there's a thing going around and i'm starting to agree with it you know there's rappers and then there's mcs and I, I'm starting to really agree with that, you know, like, I, I think there's a lot of people that are just ruining the name rappers, you know, in general, so now we have to say the people who are truly talented are MCs, because they actually spit real shit, you know what I mean, like, it's getting that bad, um, but no, I, I just love what he's talking about. It, it's just, he, he, he just, like I said, wants to stick to himself, wants to be true, doesn't want to switch up for anyone. And he's always going to do it because he feels, like he said, he may be down right now, but he knows his time is going to come. And that's that's the mindset you have to have. So I'm fucking, I'm digging this. I'm sorry I'm talking a lot, but this is, this just gets, Khan's music just gets me in the mood for discussion you know and that's what i love about it i love i don't know it, it's just dope as fuck be down right now but not forever maybe down this for a moment at a time i'll live forever through these records never die the way i bounce back 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 i may be down this for a moment at a time
This man, I swear, has some of the weirdest endings to his songs. I, I don't know what it is, but he has some of the weirdest fucking endings in a lot of his songs, too. Like, one of them, I, I, I think it was White Lines, I think. It was a music video, right? Someone came out of the house, he's smoking a blunt, and he tells him, get the fuck back inside, he's trying to smoke his... Bro, like, this man has some of the weirdest endings but i love it i fucking love it um i love that chorus too you know it was i don't know why but it's giving me old you know 90s 2000 type vibes hip-hop like that's that's the type of vibe i'm getting from that chorus it, it's just dope as fuck and then he comes in with that type of flow in the middle right there that was that was just crazy but yeah basically this was just you know about him knowing that his time is going to come and that he's not really worried about, you know, trying to get there quicker rather than get there in one piece, if you know what I mean. Like, instead of just, like I've been saying, like a lot of artists do, just hop on trends and get there quicker. You know, he's going to take the long road, like he says in a lot of his songs, but he'll make it there eventually. And he's confident in that. And I'm confident in that, too, because this man has some of the most insane complex bars you will ever fucking hear in your life and it's it's just crazy how he comes up with them you know what i mean some of them bro some of them i'm just like what you know what i mean like it just makes your brain scramble and you're like bro how does he do this you know his flows are always nasty always switching them up He's just, I don't know how he's still underrated. You know what I mean? Like, I seriously don't know how. And he's always making new music. It, it, like, this man has so many songs. Just watch. All these are your guys' suggestions for con songs that I put on the list. Well, I put everyone on the list, but you know what I mean? Shit ton. And he, these aren't even all his songs. This man's got... Bro, crazy, 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 for real. But anyway, that's going to be the reaction to Bounce Back by Khan. Now, if I had to rate it for meaning, definitely a 25. Khan usually never seems to have a song that's not meaningful. You know what I mean? Like, no matter what type of song it is, he's always going to throw in that meaning in there. And that's what I love about him. Um, bars... 25 even though it was a quite a short verse in my opinion um but it was still dope as fuck and like i said just full of meaning and full of what he's feeling you know just getting shit off his chest and i love that i love when artists vent you know it, it's just it's how they get through their day and when they do that and you hear it you can get through your day better you know it, it's dope as fuck enjoyability definitely 15 Delivery, 25. Delivery for Khan will always be a 25. This man never fucks up his delivery. He, he, I just don't think he can. I, I don't think it's possible for Khan to fuck up his delivery. And if you think he has, let me know the song because I definitely want to check that out. Because I'm interested to hear that. I really don't think it's possible. I don't. Um, beat choice, definitely a 10. I was, like... Like I said in the beginning, where it was like that smooth, you know, nice, happy vibe. And then the beat dropped, and then he came in. Bro, that was nasty. This beat was exactly what it needed to be for this song. Um, so all together, it's going to be a 10 out of 10. I think it's a solid fucking score, honestly. Like, I love just everything that I've heard from Khan. And I can't say that about a lot of artists. You know, I really can't. I can't say that I like every single song from an artist. But Khan, I haven't heard a bad song yet. And that's saying something. But with all that being said, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I appreciate all the feedback and all the support. It really means a lot. If you're not subscribed already, please hit that sub button. It would really help me out. We are doing a giveaway at 500 subs. We are going to be giving away some AirPods and an Elgato. All you have to do to be entered in the giveaway is just hit that sub button, stay in the comments, and stay supporting. 
Please hit that notification bell to see when I upload. I try to upload at least five to six times a week. I hope you guys have a fantastic day slash night. Much love and peace out.